Welcome back. We are moving into module two, lesson two, copper cable and connectors. And we have a couple of laps of this section. We're gonna do the first lap, which is two two seven, connect to an Ethernet network. And we're gonna launch the lab. And you are a network technician for a small corporate network. The owner of the company has asked you to connect to the network while the new employee is in an orientation meeting. In this lab, your task is to connect the workstation in Office 1 to the Ethernet local area network using a twisted pair cable. Then you need to confirm that the office workstation is connected to the local network and the internet. On the office, select hardware to go to the workstation. So inside the office, office one, we need to select hardware. And we can see that this is a workstation to the Ethernet using a local area network cable. So let's go and take a look at the back of the computer to see what we have. We're going to zoom in. And we have a network card that has no connection. So what we need to do is get to the closet and look for a cable. So we have a network cable here. We have two of those cables and those cables are CAT6A, RJ45. And we're going to select it and connect to the Ethernet port of the computer. Before we do that, before we do that, we want to make sure the computer is turned off, right? This is telling us that the computer is on, so we want to shut it down and then go to the back and connect the cable. Then we get the other cable and we bring it to the uh, to the connection. That's not the right connection. That's the red connection. And if we zoom in, we can see that this one is for telephone line. This is an RJ11 connector. And we need to connect to the network, which is the RJ45 connector. All right. RJ45 is the type. RJ11 is the telephone type. So let's remember this, that the network connections are always in red. Once the connection is done, we go back to the front of the computer and we turn it on. We can also see in the back of the computer that the activity light is working and the power is also working. This is the power, but it's pretty much telling us the connection from one end to the other. Okay, so we're going to go back. Uh, we are back in Windows, and we need to confirm that the Office One workstation is connected to the local internet. So we go into Windows, we do network and internet settings, we click Ethernet, and we can see that we are assigned an IP automatically using the HTTP service. Automatically assigned with a link speed of one gigabit, and this is our network IP address. So all this configuration has been sent to the computer by the DHCP server, and this is all we need to do in this lab. Let's go ahead and score, and bingo. Hope you enjoy this video, and we will move to the next video. Thank you for watching.